Hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel Nassim Padasale. So this video is regarding the confusions among students after seeing this notice like public notice dated today subject wise shift wise schedule for joint CSER UGC NET June 2021 examination. So here they have released a public notice on today. So after seeing this particular schedule, life science students, they are getting confused. Okay. So you all know earth sciences, physical sciences, mathematical sciences, chemical sciences. They didn't mention this groups and all. But if you take life sciences, life sciences group 1 and life sciences group 2 like that it is giving. So students are getting confused whether what is this particular thing is called. Because life sciences, many students will be right coming under life sciences botany zoology biochemistry microbiology biotechnology so students are getting confused in that mindset so this video is entirely is regarding the clarification with respect to group one and group two so before entering into it I, I would like to show you an important pdf that has been that i had retired from this notice board arcade so here this is a press released on december 2020 examination cycle so here with respect to subject category gender wise number of candidates registered and appeared so here you can be able to see for chemical sciences uh, 60,000 has been registered but only 39 students can appear. If you take earth sciences 10,000 plus students can registered whereas only 6,000 students has been applied. If you take mathematical sciences nearly 48,000 students can apply but only 31 students can uh, uh, return their examination. Okay and with regard to physical sciences 46 students has registered in the website but only 30,000 students has written their examination what does it mean whereas if you take life sciences means okay if you take life sciences nearly 1 lakh students will be registered for this life sciences but you know 63,000 students only appear so, okay so if you take the proportion of students and the greater amount of students will be writing your life sciences examination chemical sciences earth sci chemical sciences 39000 students and mathematical sciences also 40,000 and physical sciences also 30,000. But if you take life sciences, nearly 63,000 has written their examination. So the greater number of students will be writing your life sciences, life sciences paper. So that's the reason why they had divided the students that is group 1 and group 2. So we can say group 1 students or will be writing their examination in shift 1 and group 2 students will be writing their examination in shift 2. So if you take totally 1 lakh students has been applied for this life sciences paper all around India and if you take Tamil Nadu around nearly or from Tamil Nadu 10,000 students will be writing. Okay, so each cities in Tamil Nadu like if you take Madurai from Madurai nearly 2,000 students will be writing this life sciences paper so that's a statistical analysis okay so they cannot be able to accommodate 2,000 students at a single stretch so in shift 1 means morning shift shift 2 means more afternoon shift so in one shift itself they cannot be able to accommodate all the 2,000 students to write their examination first reason is that this COVID pandemic restrictions are higher and the next reason is that they could not be able to conduct examination since you know while writing examination there will be many invigilation will be there and many document signing procedures and all will be there so for all the 2000 students they cannot be able to conduct the uh, examination single stretch so that's the reason they will be dividing 2000 students who applied for life sciences in madurai district to two sets okay so one set that is thousands people thousand candidate will be writing your examination in morning batch and thousand students will be writing your examination in afternoon batch so that's the only reason it's, it's the only uh, significance between this group one and group two students so life science is a single paper okay this group one is still signifying the students only so all the one lakh students cannot be able to write their examination in single shift so 50,000 students will be writing their exams in group one and again remember 50,000 will be writing in group 2. So that's a reason for this life census. So every year this life census will be conducted with two groups only. Whereas in year census only 6,000 candidates will be writing all over India. So they will be conducted in single shift. Whereas physical census only 30,000. So it is easier for the exam conducting authority to accommodate all the 30,000 students in a single shift itself. It won't be a technically demanding job for them. So that's a reason why they had taken this life census and separated this life sciences into two groups group one and group two so i have i had given you a detailed clarification so please don't make yourself confused about this particular thing it is with respect to students and from the exam conducting authority only they had given this kind of things okay so i i i, I had make yourself clear so that's the reason friends thank you friends thanks for watching this video